You don't want to do that. I mean, you can if you really want to, but you're not going to like it. Sometimes not being able to see something is actually quite a good thing. Who are you? Well, my father called me Nicola, and then I killed him. So I thought I rather deserved to have his second name too, which makes me Nicola Orsinov. Pleased to meet you at last. You, um, you killed Gregor Orsinov? Yep. He got really boring, and I'm a monster. I mean, what do you want me to do? Not pull him apart? I, I did use all the bits. I, you, you don't sound Russian? How could I sound anything, silly? I'm plastic. I don't even have a voice box. I had to borrow this one. Uh, don't turn on the light. Are, are, you, are you going to kill me? No! I mean, yes, but not for a good long while yet. I don't want you to go to waste. Then, uh, then, then what? Then why are you here? After you attacked poor Sarah, I thought it was about time we had a good old chat. Face to no face. I to... well... What, what do you want? You remember that old piece of skin you were talking about? We'd like it back. We thought that mean old Gertrude had destroyed it. But then you went looking and now we think that maybe she was just very good at hiding. I'm sorry, are you asking me to find it for you? That would be lovely and a lot nicer for you than our other ideas. It... What is so important about some ancient bit of taxidermy? <laughs> I want to wear it when I dance the world new. But, but what? Uh, question time is over, little archivist. Find the skin for us. You have until, well, until I change my mind. Uh, <gasps> Save your energy for the dance. Have you been recording? Anything spooky? <coughs> Is it your Elias who listens? <coughs> Hello! <coughs> He's mine now <coughs> and you can't have him back. <coughs> <coughs> oh, don't worry. It's not for you. <coughs> you won't even need a coffin. We're going to use every piece of you. <coughs> now, could you two please move that thing somewhere far, far away? Not really. It needs to be near us. Well, just just move yourselves away and take it with you. Gotcha. Right you are. Right. Where were we? Mm -hmm. Oh, of course. So, Elias, can I call you Elias? Let me set the scene, as I know you can't actually see this. He's tied to a chair. Sarah wanted to use nails, but I talked her out of it because I'm a good friend. You're welcome. And he is absolutely surrounded with waxworks. Not good waxworks, though. Weird ones. Wax faces where you feel like you almost recognise who it's meant to be, but then instead, oh, it's downright uncanny. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, excuse me, mm -hmm. I'm talking to your boss, and I would thank you not to interrupt. Mm -hmm. You know, I must say, Elias, can I call you Elias? You have not raised this one very mm -hmm. well. He is rude. Mm -hmm. and he just will not stop asking questions. Ooh, but now I can ask the questions. How are you feeling? Mm. Oh, wonderful. Now, about the whole skin. 
skin thing. You see, originally I was just planning to have you followed in case you found that mm -hmm. ancient relic one. I mean, my goodness, it is very powerful. And if you didn't come through, well, you're quite powerful yourself. And more than that, you are symbolically appropriate. <laughs> so I thought you'd make a lovely frock. <laughs> exactly. And, well, I was going to wait, but, you know, have you ever had one of those backup plans that when you think about them, they're, they're just more fun? <laughs> so I thought, out with the old, in with, well, in with the you. <laughs> Oh, no. I'm afraid he can't see you. Can you, Elias? Can I call you, Elias? What's the point of having a secret place of power if you can't hide it from a big, stupid eye? Anyway, you sit tight. Lots to do. Oh, also, do you have a preferred brand of lotion? Because you have not been taking care of your skin and we really do need it in better shape before we peel you. All right, I'll just ask them to pick up a selection. Real, John? I, 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 I don't. None of it. None of this is real. Oh, but it is. Just because you don't understand doesn't mean it's a lie. Who are you? Why, I'm Tim, of course. Who else would I be? You're not. You're not Tim. Oh, you caught me. I'm. Shut up! No, really, it's me! Sasha, whatever her name was, back from the dead, just like you wanted. Get away from me, or, or I swear I'll, I'll... You what? Hit me? Go on then, try it. Make a fist. I, uh, I... Do you even know which of these hands is yours? S -s Stop. Stop, stop it, stand still. Do you even know what a hand is? Pathetic. Wait. Wait, I, I, I know you. I, I would hope, hope you do. do. How are you here? Don't, Don't be obtuse, John. I'm here because you failed. I, I, I tried. I, I tried. I, I almost... You almost what? You almost didn't do, do the, the world. world. No, you almost left reality to be the plaything of a lazy, foolish boy. No, 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 I, I would, I, I could have stopped it. How? You didn't even know what it was. Do you know how many people I killed to keep the world in one piece? The sacrifices I made, and you didn't even know what you were fighting. No, no, I... I, I didn't. I suppose it's of no consequence now. It's far too late. What can I do? You could, could scream, I suppose. I suppose. We, maybe. maybe. Have, Have you considered, considered curling into a ball? ball? Why are you doing this? I'm lost. You, you know, know, it's probably for the best I'm dead. Can, can you imagine how much I hate having, having to watch you fumble around as my replacement? replacement. I really cannot express how much of a disappointment you are. I, I, I'm sorry. I, I didn't even... I fought for years to stop the stranger in its tracks. And you didn't even notice when they desecrated my corpse. And now look at me. You've made me part of their ritual. This is your fault. It is not. It, it's not. I didn't know. It, it's not my fault you died. No, I suppose not. Me, on the other hand, that one is very much your fault. No, not, not you as well. Oh, yes. You told me. Why, why didn't you warn me it would be like this? I hardly had the chance, did I? 
before you left me to get my head bashed in. I understand, of course. You needed a cigarette. I suppose you should have remembered that smoking kills. That's not... I don't... I don't know. Um, Come now, archivist. Sure, you still know what a cigarette is. Or a pipe. It's hard to think. If our earlier conversation was anything to go by, I hardly think you can blame your thoughtlessness on the ritual. Your problems go far deeper than that. No, just, just to give me a, to give me a moment, Jürgen, please. You think that will help? Honestly, if I wasn't so dead, I'd be impressed. I always thought my own hubris to be quite exceptional. But you've somehow been able to get more bad decisions into two years than I managed in a lifetime. But by all means, take your moment. What do you want? I already have what I want, little Archivist. Now I just want you to join me for a dance. Ah! It's almost there. A new day. A terrible new world. And it's all your fault. Though I suppose you never really had a chance. I see you. Do you now? Yes. Yes, I, I see the sad clown. Bitter and hateful. I see him finding his way to a circus where nobody knew him. I see him torn apart, becoming the mask remade by a, a cruel ringmaster. Sometimes a dog, sometimes a mannequin, always hiding in somebody else's skin, somebody else's name. Not always, and it's far too late for any of that. Nothing you see can help you. Not without the detonator. Really, Archivist? After all this preparation, all your research, all this magnificent grotesquery, and you were just going to, what, blow it up? Probably the hunter's idea. She killed one of the couriers. Oh dear, how sad. She was also the one that damaged this shell. You have hundreds of shells, Sarah. And soon you will have tens of thousands. You can have your little lures in every dark corner of the whole world. Not until you finish the dance. Oh, just let me enjoy myself for a moment. This is a once in eternity event after all. This in between is not as comfortable for all of us as it is for you. Oh, fine. Archivist, it's been a pleasure, but I really <laughs> must. Wait, no, all of you! All of you! Will you now? <laughs> no, let them fight! It's adorable! Jim, what do you see? I see my asshole boss! <laughs> wait. Wait, spoiled sport. Tim. Grimaldi. Once, a long time ago, before Orsinov made me, and sometimes even now for special occasions, like your brother. Shall I? Tim, what's in your hand? It's... I don't... The... the, the the detonator. That's quite enough from you, you think. Ah! And now you. Go on, I'll race you. See if you can do it again before I can squeeze. It's too late. The world is out. That toy won't help you now. So come and take it. That's what I thought. I am losing my patience. Get back, get back. That's right. John, I don't know if you can hear me, but if you can, I don't forgive you. 
thank you for this. You idiot! Do you really think the world will fare any better under the Watcher? Do you think you're saving anyone? I don't care. You can't even save him! But I can hurt you. It will not end like this! You sound stressed. You know, I hear the great Grimaldi's in town. You should go see him. Cheer yourself up. That's not funny. I know.